seven innocent victims were slaughtered in Palatine, and that crime went unsolved for years. And the seven victims' families suffered, waiting to find who did this horrific crime. We stand before you today knowing that the two men who were responsible for this horrific, horrific crime, Juan Luna and Jim Degorski, have been found guilty, and they will be uh, both spending the rest of their lives in the penitentiary. So we respect the decision of the jury. After the Luna trial, we said we were survivors and that we continue to be because it's the only thing that we know how to do. Nothing will ever and nothing can ever right the horrific wrongs that have been committed by Juan Luna and James Degorski. But in his conviction, Jim Degorski, this conviction finally brings this ordeal to an end. For eight long weeks, the families have been re-traumatized, reliving the nightmare of January 8th. Jim Degorski will be incarcerated for the rest of his life. And we hope he will accept responsibility for his actions and express remorse for what he has done to the seven victims. Our lives are incomplete without the presence of our parents and our hearts will always know their loss. It's a time to heal. We are emotionally spent and exhausted. We want to get back to our families and our lives. But knowing that this, finally, this horrific ordeal is over, we want to move on. And we appreciate the other families that we have been with and gotten to know, and we have treasured the stories that we've learned about the victims. It's a time to heal. We are emotionally spent and exhausted. We want to get back to our families and our lives. But knowing that this, finally, this horrific ordeal is over, we want to move on. And we appreciate the other families that we have been with and gotten to know, and we have treasured the stories that we've learned about the victims. We are at peace knowing that two men have been convicted for this crime.